Gumballs says you're fat. <gasps> eh? <sighs> Come on, just say it. What? Well, I've lost all my money, all my friends, and my girlfriend. So it looks like you were right to take that curse seriously. Come on, just say I told you so. I don't know what you take me for, but I get no pleasure out of this. Let's just hope our family is still there. Hello? Mom? Dad? Told you so. Stop! You're being hysterical! Okay, enough. This isn't very constructive. Right! We're doing this my way now! We're getting help! Magical help. I love a tiger and just the tiniest rock. <laughs> Yes, I can try to make a potion to defend you against the Snatcher's Curse, but I will need assistance. <whistles> Sup, wizards! Uh, go get me these ingredients. Abracadoke. <coughs> Without twirling this time. Mrs. Jodenheim? Who is this Snatcher guy? There once was a young man, a mortal man, who fell in love with a beautiful ghost after seeing her in a mirror. All he wanted was to kiss her just once. In a forbidden book, he found an incantation. It allowed the living to touch a ghost. The price for this? A cursed life. Now his spirit floats in limbo, trapped behind mirrors, every day becoming more lonely, more angry, looking for someone to take his place. Ah! What? That's what you asked me for. Stand back! What are you looking at, you dumb trolls? Couldn't you see it was on fire? When the Snatcher comes for you through the mirror, Throw this at him. Uh... Sorry, I haven't done the dishes. It's not that bad. What's in it? You don't want to know. Well, what are we going to do now when the Snatcher comes? It doesn't matter. They're here. All this Snatcher stuff was baloney. Oh, man. I thought you guys were gone forever. Sure felt like it. <sighs> Your father was banned from the chicken shack, so we had to go out of town to get some. Well, they shouldn't say all you can eat if they don't mean it. Richard, you ate a chair. <sighs> go on. Say it. Say what? I told you so. I'm going to do a little dance first. <clears throat> I'm glad you're taking this gracefully. Could you pass me a wing, please? Sure! Hey, guys, leave some for us. When I saw you this morning, I recognized the Snatcher's curse. So I went to the underworld to retrieve the forbidden book. It has a solution. The only problem is that we have to wait until the sun rises. Wait, how can we know so much about all this? There once was a young man, a mortal man, who fell in love with a beautiful girl. Yeah, yeah, thanks, we know. But did you know that the young man and the ghost had a child? Uh, a zombie baby. Uh, that child was me. All right, what do we do? We survive. I've got a much better idea. How about we bail? Appreciate it if you'd stop calling him names and treat him with the respect he deserves. Glad to finally meet you, sir. He seems to have a few issues. It's not his fault. He's been turned evil by loneliness. 